Major. Now that you've reached our Voss outpost, let's begin your briefing. Voss was first discovered by the Empire. As always, the Imperials' first thought was invasion, but the Voss people repelled them with ease. Apparently, their mystics can predict the future with complete precision. Word spread quickly, and gaining the Voss as allies has become a top Republic priority. Anyone who can see the future is a good friend to have. True, but we can't afford to lose sight of the overall war effort. Our problem is with the strategy employed by the Republic's influential diplomat, Senator Evren. Evren is certain that the Empire will invade again, and he's withholding thousands of frontline troops to leap to Voss's defense. This cannot continue. How can Havoc Squad free up those troops, General? You can make their presence unnecessary. Unfortunately, Evren is a close friend of the Supreme Chancellor and has his complete confidence. Even I can't overrule him now. Our only alternative is for your team to demonstrably destroy any and all invasion vectors the Empire has left. Once Voss is safe, we can get our troops back. Tell me where to begin, General. You'll begin by reporting to Senator Evren in his office in the alien enclave of Voss Ka, the planet's mountain capital. Evren has agreed to talk, but he still holds all the cards, Major. Conduct yourself accordingly. I won't give the Senator any reason to complain. Good. We have enough run-ins with the Senate as it is. Also, remember that Voss is neutral territory. Imperial personnel are just as welcome as we are, so make absolutely sure that your operations remain covert. Report back to me when the situation is dealt with. Garza out. Major, Captain Marshall, sir, 81st Infantry. It's a real pleasure to meet you. You must be Senator Evren's reserves. You mean the Vacation Brigade. That's what everyone's calling us, right? Keep it down, Private. Sorry, Major, we heard a rumor you might be here to get us back into the field. Is that true? Operation details are top secret, Captain. Sorry. Come on, Major. We're bouncing off the walls here. Give us something. That is enough, Private. I want a weapons check, armor clean, and gear stow in five. Move it. And, Major, if that is why you're here, then good luck. We're all dying to get back out there and crack some hip skulls. So long. Ah, oh, Major. Please, come in. Make yourself comfortable. I was just having dinner brought in. Would you care to join me? I understand it's being paired with an excellent Chandlin wine. Much obliged, Senator. But I'm afraid the mission has to come first. Of course. You have a duty to carry out. I can certainly respect that. While I appreciate that General Garza sent her best, I have reservations with her plan. The military action here is very risky. The Voss have strictly forbidden violence between Republic and Imperial visitors. I maintain... It would be better to wait for the Empire to make the first move. If we wait for the Imperials to attack, we have to fight on their terms. Is the ambush no longer an accepted military maneuver? It seems like a perfectly valid strategy to me, and the Supreme Chancellor agrees. If you believe you can completely destroy the Empire's ability to invade this planet without being discovered by Voss authorities, so be it. You'll work under my direct supervision, and I'll observe your activities through your armor cam. Cross any lines, and the mission ends. Is that clear? This op will go by the numbers, Senator. I'm glad we understand each other. Now, take a look at these reports from the SIS. An Imperial agent called Deadfall has landed on Voss. Deadfall's specialty is subterfuge. He sows confusion and chaos on a planet just before the Empire sends its invasion forces. His presence proves their intentions. Do you know where he is now? The SIS believes Deadfall is hiding in a cave system at the foot of Vaska. The coordinates are in the reports. I believe the best course of action is for you to search the caves for data, hopefully capturing Deadfall himself in the process. Agreed. I'll make it happen, Senator. Then we're already off to a good start. And remember, I'm watching. I... I'm speechless. Is it always like that in the field? Is there always that much... killing? It's unfortunate, but it's necessary. A gruesome necessity. Enough! Let's just get on with the assignment. I have Agent Keller here from the SIS to assist us. My team will take care of the heavy lifting, Major. 
Just flip the consoles on and we'll slice right in. Don't move a finger. I've got you dead in my sights. I'll kill you where you stand. You must be that guerrilla fighter I've heard so much about. You aren't asking the questions here. I am. This is your chance, Major. Take him into custody for questioning. I'll be back with you in a minute, Senator. Good luck. I don't plan on surrendering, do you? Surrender isn't an option. Then let's finish this. Major, you were supposed to capture him alive. You were supposed to bring him in for questioning. Some men never surrender. Save your excuses. I'm not interested. Now, the consoles. Let's hope they even have half of the information Deadfall could have given us. Got a hit. Multiple deliveries from Paul Blex. He's an arms smuggler here on Voss. Blex must be smuggling weapons to the Empire. Blast. We've been watching the wrong ships. What is Blex's location? I'm forwarding the pickup coordinates from the imp files. Looks like a good place for Blex to be hiding out. Go there and question him right away, Major. And I mean that. Don't just go in there shooting this time. If I may add, sir, this area is also home to the Shrine of Healing. It is a sacred place in Voss culture and presents many diplomatic opportunities. How does this Shrine of Healing tie into our plans? Entering the Shrine of Healing requires the completion of a very dangerous series of trials. Few outsiders have ever gained entry. By completing the trials, you would further demonstrate to the Voss that we are worthy of their friendship. I'll try, Koro. But the mission has to come first. Agreed, sir. It's worth investigating, but not at the expense of our primary mission. I leave the matter to your discretion, but your help would be invaluable. Also be warned that this area is one of many infested by the Gormak, a dangerous local race that has warred with the Voss for centuries. One of the locals, Suvarak, can tell you much more. Good luck. I'm with Republic Special Forces. I need to speak to Paul Blex. Este no cadí. Banuk maraca naja, cadmi ma bam, yak manala, ni baga kamka, kakam, glak ni mu amagarak. I want to know what you delivered to the Empire. Nu amem yaki, amanara pe baga. Naya Naramkam, Kala Amka Mani Mani, Libik Bak. I won't tell the Imperials if you don't, Blex. Nanu Namga Niak. Bakada Kalam Kada. Nanaya Oramang. Here, now tell me what you want. Nemka Gininak. Kalam Jiwa Nimuk. Pemgam Yamanaya Agam. What kind of bomb? A ZR-57 orbital strike bomb? Them kem naya nugan. Jinnam nayam lak umgam mege. Homo gala apayayang. Nemala ima amak amga. Nuli lak apaja kagam. Amka nem nag nemnoa inuk. Nicely done, Major. You turned a violent confrontation into a reasonable negotiation. I'm glad you were satisfied with my work, sir. So am I. As for the information, what do you make of it, Agent Keller? Too early to say. Gotta run some numbers. Try and figure out where they'd go with tunneling equipment and a bomb. If the bomb is a ZR-57, you can track its radiation signature. Good thinking. I'll get scanning equipment out to the team. In the meantime, I want you back in my office. An important diplomatic meeting is coming up, and Havoc Squad would make an excellent honor guard. I'll proceed to your office immediately, sir. Have it out. Major, good. Just in time to start the meeting. I'll need you right over there. 
I'll help however I can, sir. I appreciate it. This meeting is critical. Gonsa, a representative of the Voss, has agreed to meet with myself and Lord Torius from the Empire. These meetings are a rare opportunity to impress the Voss. Just let me do the talking. I'll stay out of your way, Senator. Thank you. I appreciate your help in this matter. Senator Everin, sir, your guests have arrived. Ah, welcome, Gonsa. On behalf of the Galactic Republic, allow me to express what an honor it is to speak with you. I will hear your words. Speak your offer. Words are all that the Republic can offer, my friend. Unlike the Empire, they lack the strength to do anything more. Such hostility, my lord. You see, Gonsa, the Empire doesn't respect anyone. Joining them would make your people nothing more than slaves. Pure slander. In the Empire, power is respected above all else. And the Voss are a powerful people, worthy of high regard, Gonsar. We have thrived alone for millennia. Why join anyone? Many of the advantages to joining the galactic community you've seen firsthand, from the modernization of Voska to opportunities for trade. Gonsar, problems have developed. You are required. Problems? My friend, please, allow the Republic to help you however we can. Let us prove our worth. Yes. The soldier. You will help. How can I be of assistance, sir? Voss commandos are trapped in Gormak territory. A rescue. Of course. Proceed to the commando's coordinates, Major. There isn't a moment to lose. I'll have the Voss's men safe in no time, sir. Best of luck, Major. I hope the mission goes as smoothly as Senator Everin believes it will. Come, men. Senator? That's quite far enough, Major. We have the rescue operation well in hand. Sadly for Havoc Squad, the challenge of the Gormak was simply too much. Your remains won't be recovered for some time. My condolences. I'm here to rescue the Voss, not to fight you. Yes, which is exactly why no one will know we had anything to do with your death. Men, open fire! You arrive as predicted. We return alone. I'd be happy to escort you back to Voss Ka, sir. We return alone. Major, this is Senator Everett. We have a serious problem. Agent Keller's team discovered where the Empire is hiding their bomb, but not before being spotted by Imperial security. The team's speeder was damaged during their escape. They've crash-landed in the Dark Heart, part of the Nightmare Lands. You have to get there right away. I'll move out immediately, sir. Hold a minute for intel. Koru? The Nightmare Lands are no place for the unprepared. I've seen the reports. Severe psychological effects are common. You should speak with Talon Day, a Voss commando stationed in the area. He supposedly knows of a way to avoid or prevent these effects. I'll find Talon Day and see what he knows. Go as fast as you can, Major. There isn't a moment to lose. I'm looking for Talon Day. I need protection against the Nightmare Lands. Laren Kai sent word. You follow the Gormax path. The Nightmare Lands have been since the dawn of Oz. They hold many secrets. Enter lightly, and you will be lost to madness. I've seen harsh conditions before. I won't lose my head. Your mind is the battlefield. Rarely does the darkness lose. 
The mystic Kida created a ritual of cleansing. It is our only protection. If you hope to survive the Nightmare Lands, you must complete Kida's ritual. Will a Voss ritual work on an outsider? It will protect you from madness. Death is another matter. You will need a dark crystal. Several grow in caves throughout the Nightmare Lands. Deadly Veratikai have made the caves their home. Defeat these beasts to reach the crystals. Use the crystal to cleanse the corrupted. It will trap the darkness that drives the mad. How will I know who needs to be cleansed? The corrupted wander blind. They will attack. Be quick. After the corrupted have been cleansed, take the crystal to the ruins nearby. Place the crystal before the ancient tablets. Meditate. You will gain Kida's wisdom. The darkness will no longer harm you. Find the crystal, use it on the corrupted, take it to the ruins, and meditate. Follow Kida's ritual. Only then will you be safe. Completed Kida's ritual. The Voss are cleansed. Few outsiders heed my warnings. You are better. You have strength. The Nightmare Lands cannot harm you. What? No! Get away from me! Stay back! I'll kill you! No. No, no, I'm sorry. Please help me. My head... Everything keeps spinning. I, I I can't think straight. See what you can do for him, Dorn. Agent, focus on my eyes, sir. I need you to take deep, slow breaths. My team. We crashed. We took shelter here, but they were plotting. Plotting behind their eyes. I had to do it. They would have killed me. If I hadn't killed them, they would have killed me. Why would you shoot your own men? I I, I don't know. What was I thinking? We, we were a team. We worked together for years. Take this. Take it! It has coordinates. The Imperials are there, tunneling. This will get you through the security door. Tell their families. Agent! I have no pulse. He's gone. This agent, all of these agents, gave their lives to stop the Empire. Let's make it count. He's gone, isn't he? The whole team is gone. They were only supposed to observe. How could this happen? We have the imp's location, sir. We need to strike now. You're right, yes. Yes, you're right. I want you to go to those coordinates, Major. I want you to make the Imperials pay. Use all necessary force. Ever and out. Ah, oh, Major. I rather suspected our paths might cross again, though not like this. I must give Senator Everin credit. Sending you here was a bolder move than I expected from him. Your plan is finished. Give it up. I think you overestimate your chances. With this weapon buried beneath their capital, the Voss will have no choice but to submit. Clearly their abilities were no match for the power of the dark side. I won't let you hold this planet hostage, Torius. The people of Vos already belong to the Empire. They just don't know it yet. Every detail of the operation was chosen at random from dozens of fully developed alternatives. With all possibilities equal, no single plot was foreseen. This operation has been a masterpiece of ingenuity. One that you have no place in. Guards, remove this filth. If you surrender now, Torius, it'll go much easier. No wonder everyone could get you to come here. You truly are insane. Guards! How can this be? You're only human. No match for the power of a full-blooded Sith. Things didn't have to happen this way, Torius. Oh, be quiet. I'll hear no more from you. This isn't finished. I cannot be killed by vermin. 
right. You. I. I. No pulse. No breathing. He's dead, sir. Major? What are you doing here? The mystic Kai Vei foresaw Lord Torius' actions and yours. Boss is safe. The Republic was happy to help you deal with this threat. There is more. Kai Vei comes to see this bomb. Its technology is unknown. Give us the bomb for study. We will give weaponry in trade. This is top secret Republic technology. I'm not authorized to give it away. Then we leave. I'll have a Class 7 retrieval team brought to our coordinates straight away, Major. Major, looks like you got us a real treat here. Jack, Garen, check those rad seals, would you? We can handle things from here, sir. Feel free to head back to Senator Everin's office. Oh, Major, come in. Have a drink with me. You did some truly fine work here on Poss. Not even Torius could stop you. I'm just glad things worked out, sir. Well, more or less. Unbelievably, even after everything the Empire did, the Voss refused to take a side. I'm sure you'll persuade them eventually, sir. We can only hope. In any event, you've done your part. The Empire clearly won't be invading Voss again anytime soon. You're one of the finest representatives for the Republic that I've ever met. The troops are yours. And don't hesitate to contact me if I can do more. Those troops will make a big difference, sir. It's been a pleasure. Take care out there, Major. Hello, Major. Our troops are already back on the move. More than one senior general is singing our praises at the moment. Possibly even more impressive, Senator Everett's staff sent me a very complimentary message regarding your conduct. Apparently, you made a good impression. I'm glad I was able to represent us well. Yes. And that's always very helpful in times like these. With more manpower on the ground to supplement our space forces, the tide of this campaign will finally turn in our favor. We're only a few steps away from General Rackton himself. He'll have to commit his personal forces somewhere soon. When he does, you'll be there to strike. When we get our shot at Rackton, I'll be ready. I'm glad to hear it. Unfortunately, a situation has developed in the Senate. A hearing to investigate Special Forces' recent activities? You've been called to testify. I'll head back to Coruscant immediately. Good. I'll give you a full briefing once you arrive. Garza out. <laughs>